Hey guys, RC here. Welcome back, Football Manager 19, episode 12. We're with Sarah Largo. No job offers here in the off season. Uh, we are at the end of January. We've got about a week left in the transfer market. Uh, we have not been active this year. I'm actually trying to sell players so I have enough money to sign the one player I really wanted. Uh, that I came across. But anyway, uh, we had a 4-1 defeat to Belgrano. Uh, Enzo Martinez with the only goal. This was playing our 4-1-4-1 uh, uh, Leeds system that uh, we got promoted with a couple years ago and played a lot last year. Uh, I switched over to the, uh, the old 4-4-2 with the uh, two uh, Segunda Volante or the Volante and Anchor. Uh, that you probably are familiar with me playing a lot because uh, I started playing that in FM 18. Uh, but anyway, we got a 3-1 win over Pinarol. Uh, we had a goal from Ballesteros on the left wing and Magalenas with two goals. Uh, so they had a player sent off in the 32nd minute. We made that count. Uh, then we kept that system. Palermo, we beat 6-1. Lopez and Ramirez with hat tricks. And then we beat Roca 6-0. Ramirez with another hat trick. The Winter Soldier, Trasante, and Ballesteros with goals. Uh, the Winter Soldier, I believe, is out of contract. Uh, no, he's under contract for six more months. Um, he, oh, he also broke the goal-scoring record for the league, not the club, for the Premier Division last year with his, uh, with his goals. So uh, 16 goals, 29 appearances, uh, new league record. So kudos to him. Uh, he is, he's 31 now. Um, he is dropping. So I'm probably, I'm probably not going to renew him when his contract's up mid-season. Isn't it weird that these are expiring mid-season? That's so weird. Uh, anyway. Uh, taking a look at finances real quick before we get in, I've had to adjust the budget a little bit. So we're right at the payroll cap. Uh, we have no transfer budget. Uh, taking a look at transfers, uh, we have moved out. Kevin Marrera finally moved on for 23-5 to San Luis. Uh, Nicholas Cabrera went on a free, and we have loaned out uh, our reserve keeper, Centurion, on a loan to get him some playing time. And the reason that we did that is we have signed Damian Ferreira on a free from Pinnerall. He has been on loan with us for a while. Uh, this is his uh, third season. His loan expires in June, and the contract that we signed will pick up in June. So we will, uh, you know, he'll move into our, uh, so he's going to be with us long term now. Uh, and what else? These are all pending. Uh, da, da, da. Yep, he's coming in. Uh, we've got contract offers out on a few guys. We had one on Anchetta. He rejected it. So we're still trying to move him. Uh, Cena's is pending. Again, I'm trying to pick up some, uh, some money. I need about $33,000 to be able to complete a transfer that's already agreed to. I've just had to delay it and I'm probably going to lose it because of what's going on here. But so anyway, the club looks remarkably similar, uh, just a few differences. Uh, so let's get into today's match. We're playing on the road. Uh, we are underdogs against Phoenix and it's a breezy day. They have uh, sold out just about 500 people. So I am going to play this tactic, especially when we're underdogs. Uh, this is really an underdog style tactic. Uh, so we're going with uh, Lopez up top. Uh, why? I have no idea because he kind of sucks. Um, yeah, he's not very good. Why am I doing that? Um, because a lot of people are out. That would be the big reason why. So let's see. If we take a look here, Ramirez is injured. So he's my starting striker, uh, two weeks. Winter Soldier's up top. Frederico Andrade I could put up there. Uh, his, 
He's got much better finishing. Bruno Ramirez is, is injured. Uh, Roberto Lopez is not very good. Uh, you know, I do like... I'm going to give Trasante the start. The, they're, they're not good at the false nine. That's what this tactic calls for. Um, I have found over the seasons, over the years, that they can play. I mean, they have the ratings there. I mean, if we look at Trasante, for example, I mean, there's, you know, he can't pass very well, right? But he can do everything else. So, you know, he's not going to be great, but he can do the job. So I don't pay a lot of attention at the striker positions for this. It is what it is. But we've got a lot of guys out injured, suspensions. Uh, Vina is suspended. Uh, that was that must have been from the last game of last season. So uh, anyway, uh, and Trabatini, Trabatoni is going to be our new reserve keeper, 18-year-old. Uh, we had youth intake a couple of weeks, about a week ago. Not very good. Um, anyway, let's get to it. That's what we're going to go with. The player I'm going after is a center back. I don't need him, but he would actually be our number one center back if he signed. And that's kind of how I gauge things. If I need, you know, if I need, if somebody can become my top player. Ooh, I want to pause this real quick. I just want to double check something. Yeah, we're fine there. Fine there. Awesome. Awesome. Oh. A little takedown on my guy there, buddy. Uh, let's see. We want to extend that. And that. And league table. Do I want league table or league scores? I think league latest scores. I think that's what we'll go with. Everything else here is good. And we can go match. There we are. There we go. Wanted to make sure I wasn't playing offsides trap or anything stupid. All right, there's Teixeira. Laid off to Mullins. Over the top, Ballesteros. Oh, good, good defensive header. A good clear by him. Vidal. Oh, Nestor Santos. Second goal of the season. All right. How's he got two goals already, and this is the first goal he scored? Shouldn't be counting cups, or we haven't even had a cup match yet. Oh, my God. Yeah. We're just, you know, Phoenix is much better than we are. Um I was not able to strengthen the squad this year. We are up against it on the cap you saw. Ugh, that sucks. Uh, get creative. Okay. I'm going to try something here. I don't normally do. Let's go with a slightly higher. We've got decent pace on the back line. I don't want to play that super high line, but I don't want to play deeper either. Uh, we can skip this. I, I really don't need to see much more. Man, I don't know if we're going to have a highlight. Oh, there we go. Trasante, the Winter Soldier, gives it away. Mullins. Oh, nice little header to himself. Lays it back to Shara. Squared across to Feller. Fowler. Trasante. The winner soldier with the pop. Top of the box. Nice try. All right. We just had to find our footing, maybe. Unfortunately, we're, you know, six feet under by the time we find our footing. Laid off. 
crossed in. Oh, what a shot by the Winter Soldier. Get in there. I, it would have it would have been so cool. So he dominated the first the opening stage of last year. He came within a whisker of scoring the final goal in the final minute of the last game of last year, and then he gets our opening goal this year. Doesn't get much better than that. Uh, let's see, two clear cuts. We have one clear, one half. We're we're not doing. Oh, hello. I guess Trasante wanted uh just wanted an early day. Um yeah, well, that's all right. Nothing I could do about that. Little frustration set in. Uh da, 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 da. calm down. All right. Yep, that guy let it go cuz he knew he was offside. Smart play by their guy. We got the clearance. No shot in hell at this game now. Oh, my God. A gashed upper leg. All right. We'll see how he looks at halftime. Uh, 69. Yeah, let's go ahead and yank him. Oh, boy. Andrade. We'll go with an early sub. Pep talk. Uh, yeah, I mean, they've been playing... They've been playing okay. Hadn't been, you know, I mean, they gave up some really bad goals, but. Oh, nice ball. Oh, I thought he was going to make a run on it there. Oh, I thought we were real close there. Surprisingly, we have not just been completely gashed open here uh, since the sending off, have we? I'm going to go a little bit longer. All right, let's go there. Um, let's bring Pena on. Oh, there's a lump over the top. I don't know where he was going, but that's all right. Nice header, Andrade. Poor pass. You ever notice on... Oh, damn it. Damn it! Well, not the start I was hoping for. Definitely not the start I was hoping for. Boo! All right, um... Bring him on for Martinez. Martinez is not playing too great today. You know, we have Mark tight. We have closed down. Hmm. Well, I hope my power doesn't go out because it looks like it's starting to storm outside. Yep, kind of need to get to the end of the game because I need to see what's going on. Bear with me here a minute, guys. Sorry. Oh yeah. Oh, it's it's a it's a torrential deluge outside. Um. Luckily, it's been a couple. Of, you know, it's been about a week since the flooding occurred. Um. So that water's all gone by now. Um, so this isn't going to be a, a worry. But still, <laughs> you know, you're just like, eh. I'm sure that I've got some neighbors on my block that are probably uh, holding their breath right now. All right, Pena, Andrade. There's a nice shot. Show some pride, boys. We, we may lose this game, but keep pushing. Push forward. With some good ball movement. I'm proud of the boys. Can't be too upset with them at this point. I really think if we hadn't been down a man, that we may have uh, fared a little better. Uh, and I think Mollins hit it off himself. Jesus. 
All right, fair enough. Not the start we wanted, but I think that could have been worse. So, yeah, I'm going to say you, you guys looked all right. You guys looked all right. Um, we'll be through the transfer window for the next game. We're going to definitely come back. Two weeks. We have got... I'm going to issue a warning. It was It was a... Uh, wait a minute. Was that... Was that a straight red? It, if it was a straight red, I got I got a, yeah, straight red. <laughs> Sorry, uh, fine two week salary. Boop. Yeah, I'm a hard ass when it comes to straight red cards. So we'll go through the transfer window. Uh, we'll have that completed when we come back for uh, La, La Valea. Uh, so we'll come back for that one here in a second, and we'll wrap up transfers. Hopefully I can move a couple of these guys and sign that center back. Fingers crossed. Because it looks like we might need that center back. All right. See you guys in a bit. All right. We are back. Transfer deadline has passed. We have seen a flurry of activity. Uh, Mateo Cena went to Carmelita on loan. Matthias Vina went out for $52,000. Uh, so that picked us up some money. Uh, let's see. Oh, and then we picked up five guys. All of these were dead deadline deals. So let's take a quick look at them. Some of them are okay. Some of them are not okay. Some of them were uh, were panic buys, probably. At least one of them was probably a panic buy, just because he looked okay. Uh, with the injuries that we had up top, they were gonna, you know we were gonna be without several players, you know, for several weeks or a month or so. I wanted to strengthen up the uh, the front line. So let's take a look at what we got. Uh, Juan, I, I'm thinking that's Jean Mike Manuel Carrasco. I don't think that's Joan. I don't think that's how it's pronounced, but maybe I'm wrong. But uh, Carrasco, uh, two and a half star current, four star potential. He's a striker up top. He's got good physicals, composure, anticipation off the ball. Uh, heading is okay. First touch finishing are strong. 5'11", 165. Uh, gives us some depth. Uh, can't play the false nine, but that's okay. Uh, Augustin Perez also comes in on a free. He is a center back and a left back. He can, uh, his, his three main technicals are solid, 10 to 13. He's got some pace acceleration. He's 6'1", so he can play the, the center solidly. Uh, he can play the left side if we need, although his crossing's horrible. He wouldn't be very good as a wing back or an attacker. Uh, Facundo Mendez, another striker and winger. Uh, again, solid physicals, three star potential, uh, current three and a half uh, potential. Finishing solid, first touch, dribbling is good, heading is good. Uh, so off the ball, decision making, composure. I think he's going to be pretty solid for us. Uh, Jose Mayala, uh, he comes in on a free, another center back. Uh, again, solid technicals, solid technicals, good pace. Acceleration's a little lacking. This is a guy that the, they said, you know, that I got the thing. Oh, the fans think he's a reach. Yes, he is 26. He doesn't have a whole lot of potential, but he's not horrible. He won't be a starter, but he's a solid defender. Solid header, solid jumping. I think he could be a decent player. So, and probably, well, he can't pass. So, no, I wouldn't like him up in that defensive mid. And then this was the guy that we were after the whole time. Uh, so, with the sale of Vina, I was able to finally sign him. He's a Bolivian center back, three and a half star current, four star potential. I think he's our new starting center back. Uh, Solid pace, jumping reach, 6'2", 13s and 14s. I think this guy is solid. He'll really upgrade us. We're paying him a chunk ass of money. <laughs> now, he is hurt. He's got a groin strain. Uh, he was injured. Uh, he was playing with Oriento Petro Petrolero, Petroleum Orient. You remember those guys. Uh, so he's going to be out for a little while, but he was out of contract. So we were able to jump on him and sign him. Uh, so anyway, finances, we are pretty strapped. I've moved everything down. We're about, uh, 35,000 over, uh, thanks to that $114,000 deal. I will deal with that. Um, 
we do have some people that will be coming off uh, at the uh, end of the season or mid-season, so uh, we'll see how that goes. Uh, so let's get into it. We've registered everybody. Uh, we are actually heavily favored in this one, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to pop back up into our more attacking formation. So Mendez, why, why do they want to start Mendez? Oh, Mendez is our new guy. Yeah, debut. Okay, that's why. Because he's pretty good. Biasteros, uh, Winter Soldier is injured. Lietes, so both of my starting wingers are injured. Quintero, uh, the cent new center back, is injured. Trasante is suspended. Uh, he's actually wanted on loan. I was... I was going to keep him because he was my number four option. I think he may be number five now, but when he's not suspended, he'll he'll be in the mix probably on the bench. And this is a guy, Israel Herrera, he's not very good. He's got some potential. He's only 19. We signed him. I need to get him some playing and training. So I went ahead and registered him. Last season, the game, when I, you know, I do the auto register typically. The game left him out. I was like, I got to put the kid in so he can play, right? I mean, you know, we'll, we'll try. So we've got five injuries. We've got a suspension. Uh, so let's get to it. Let me know what you think of the new signings. Uh, transfer window's done, so we're going to be cruising on. Uh, hopefully you have seen my channel update. If you haven't, go check it out. It's a quick 15-minute video on just what's going on. I've got... Uh, some stuff going on in personal life with jury duty that's going to keep me from uh, having as much playing time. Uh, so we'll, uh, you know, we're going to have to make a few changes in the short term while that's going on. It's going to be a three-week trial. But anyway, go check that out uh, if you're interested. If you're not interested, that's fine too. All right, we're in the orange. I hate these kits, man. Those orange kits are ugly, but that's all right. All right, clear favorites. I would certainly like to see. Oh fuck! All right, Ferreira. I'm, 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 oh, I'm se severely questioning my decision to sign him. How in the crap does he not? It's in the net before he even jumps. It's like he's blind. Maybe I need to give him an eye test. Mullins, Pena, Vieira, squared outside, Ballesteros, a header. Oh, my God, Moro Mullins beats the keeper to the near post. That keeper looks as shit as ours. <laughs> that shouldn't have went in. Hey, I got a little dot up there. Let me scoot it over. There we go. Yeah, not sure. Not sure about that. Honestly, I'm surprised it's not three to nothing or three to one. You know, we have we have three shots all on target. They've got one. We should all have we should have four four goals in total. All right, Vieira taken down. Teixeira comes back to get control. Arsheta. A nice vision out to Fowler. Squared in. There's a blast. Maximiliano Vieira, his first goal of the season. Fowler with the assist. Fowler's that young left back. If he develops, he could be pretty good. Chumped into the box. Pena. Back out to Fowler. Horrible cross in. Another shot. Oh, how did that not go in? A little bit of wood action. Sporting the woody a little bit. Marchetta, Pena. How about you guys spread out a little bit? That would be awesome. Mollins. Oh, Mollins tried to take it all the way into the goal. <laughs> all right, Teixeira, Marchetta. Oh, hello. What, ha what happened there? All right, over into a lot of space, Martinez. No, that was pretty horrible. That was horrible. Surprised 
surprised we don't have a yellow card yet. Now we're going to get six. Cross it. Cross it. Damn it. Damn it. Couldn't pull the trigger. Good save by the keeper. We should have put that one in, though. Oh, there's Teixeira with a yellow card. All right, we're not feeling too left out of the action. Oh, Vieira with the steal. And he kicks it right to Sanchez. Oh, oh, Ballesteros. Oh, he pounced. What a goal. Oh, he just picked the pocket of that poor defender. Oh, I think that defender is going to have nightmares about that for weeks. That was brilliant. Three to one. All right. Oh, this is a cup match. This is not a league match. Uh, this is the, uh, the Uruguayan Copa Uruguaya. Yes, that's it. 424 people in attendance. Our traveling fans almost outdrew them. That's pretty sad. All right. Excellent efforts. Playing well. Actually, a game like this could help us out this early in the season. Get the morale up. Get the confidence up. I think that could be good. Could be good. Fowler. Uh, I thought we were going to have a play there, man. Man? 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 Uh, praise. Yes, fired up. All right. I want to try. We're up three to one, right? So let's do this. Um, bum, bum, bum. Vieira, Arsheta. Arsheta's playing well. Pena's on a yellow, so we'll pull him out. Um, let's put Andrade up top. And what else we want to do here? Anthony Fowler, left back. Okay, Tashira for Fowler, and then Fowler for Fernandez. Yeah, Fernandez is not quite as good a defender. He's got some potential, but he needs to improve. All right, we'll go with that. Just want to put in that that other tactic. Just kind of see at that in, in action in a game where we are, uh, you know, that we're doing well, and we can afford to kind of play around a little bit. Mullins, not down. All right, a little bit of pressure. Good. No, there's a header across the goal. Yes. We had a lot of set pieces out of this formation, a lot of corners like that where we got goals. Those friendlies where we were getting six goals, that was with this tactic. So uh, that was nice. Oh, little screen there by Mullins. Good job, pal. All right. Uh... Do we have any of the youngsters? Brazil, Barney, Roberto Lopez. He's 22. Uh, you know, his passing is not horrific. Uh, let's go. Wait, I was looking at Lopez. Okay, but he is a striker. Strikers are doing okay. Um, bum, bum, bum. Let's go ahead and put him in for Arsheta. Barney on the field. Five foot two in purple. Oh. <laughs> All right, maybe this will give Ferreira some confidence, too, although, who knows. Oh, Teixeira just went ass over tea kettle. Oh, Alvarez just beats the defender, blows the keeper. Oh, yeah, you two are, oh, oh, little little Latin heat coming up there between the center back and the keeper, it looked like. Oh, little machismo. 26 shots, 15 on target. I think we might ought to have more than four goals. I'm not I'm not gonna be upset, but you know. 
That's not a great conversion rate. Oh, Mullins pounces. Nice touch out to Andrade. Squared in. Mullins. Oh, cross the keeper. His second goal. 5-2. Nice job, boys. I'm getting all excited about beating up on a poor little club. Two shots, two on target, two goals. That's not a good conversion ratio for our defense. Oh, Ballesteros, his second goal of the season. Oh, they were just piling it on. That's unfair. Call off the dogs. Maldonado's injured. Teixeira. There we go. Six to two. We really broke that open in the second half. Again, I wanted to see how we played in the second half with the other tactics. So three goals. Excuse me. Three goals. I think that did pretty well. All right. I think that's going to help everybody's morale. That's one of those games you just go, whew, that, that feels good. Um, oh, we're going to get our ass handed to us in the next one, though. Club Nacional. Uh, let's see. Well, I guess there's really nothing to see here. Um, I don't know when the draw is for the next round, but anyway. So I'll play a few games. And uh, then we'll come back. I'll see what we're at, what we're at for the next cup. And uh, yeah, and then we'll continue the season. Uh, again, we won't be having daily uploads probably um, for the next few weeks because uh, of my jury service. But check out my uh, my my channel update video if uh, you know if you're interested in finding out what's going on. Uh, so, yeah, a lot of goals there. We win. Good. So, we lived up to, all right, what's expectations here? So, reach the third round. All right, so we're in the, we're in the second round now. All right, Mendez made his debut. Belesteros was classy with two goals and two assists. All right, nothing going on there. Um... National Albion, Liverpool. Let me finish out the month. I can do that uh, here in a, in a little bit, and then I'll go ahead and record. Uh, we'll do uh, Juventude and uh, Wanderers. We'll do that. Pinnerol's probably going to destroy us. Uh, oh, there's the second round match. Well, you know what? If we want to come back for that, let's come back for them and Colonia, because that's a new team, I think. So let's let's cut let's play Nationale off camera. We'll come back real quick for Albion Liverpool and then I can get another handful of games and then we'll come back for the second round and Colonia. That'll give us three episodes here in the opening two months. We're still trying to get used to the team, the, uh, the new players, so I think that's good to hit a few early episodes. And then that actually gets us halfway through the opening stage, which we'll probably have maybe two more episodes for that, uh, not counting any uh, Uruguayan Cups. Just a thought. But let's get moving. Uh, where are we at uh, competition-wise? We are horrible at zero points. One match played. Stands to reason, right? All right, guys, hit the like button, subscribe. Let me know what you think of the new players. Let me know, uh, you know, do you think they'll be worth a darn? I'm excited to get that center back back from injury. Of course, I'm excited to get a lot of players back from injury. And let's discuss in the comments, should I re-sign the winter soldier? Remember, his contract's up mid-season at the end of the opening stage. He's in his 30s now, so he's getting older. But he carried us last year. Set the new league record for scoring. I don't know. Let me know what you think. We'll talk to you guys later. Have a good one. Bye.